In this video, I'm going to be working out an individual integral. We're going to take a look at the integral of 2x squared plus 1 quantity times an e raised to the x squared. All right, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to distribute that e raised to the x squared. So I'm going to have the integral of a 2x squared e raised to the x squared plus an e raised to the x squared. All right, so all we did there was distribute that in. All right, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a look at this integral and I'm going to use my properties of integrals and I'm going to split them up into two separate integrals. And I'm going to kind of space this out so we've got plenty of room to write here. So I'm going to have the first one, which is the integral of 2x squared e raised to the x squared dx. All right, and then leaving myself plenty of room here, we're going to have the integral of an e raised to the x squared dx. All right, now on this right here, all right, well, obviously we're going to need to use an integration by parts. Um, I am going to choose to rewrite this to make that integration by parts a little bit easier. So I'm going to look at this as an x times a 2xe raised to the x squared dx. All right, and that is just simply so that I can look at this now and do my integration by parts and it's going to work out a little bit easier. Okay, now let's go ahead and write that formula down in case we have forgotten that. So it'd be the integral of a u dv is equal to a uv minus the integral of a v du. All right, just for remembering purposes here. All right, so that's my formula. So let's go ahead and identify all of our parts. So we're going to let our u be the x right there. That's going to make our du equal to a dx. All right, we're going to let our dv be equal to then everything else, which will be the 2xe raised to the x squared dx. All right, and then I need to integrate both sides there. Integrating here, I'll have a v. Integrating here, I'm going to have an e x to the second. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and apply this formula right here. So we'll go back to black here. So we'll have a x e raised to the x squared minus the integral of an e raised to the x squared dx. All right, now I'm going to just go ahead and bring this straight down plus the integral of e raised to the x squared dx. All right, so we didn't have to do anything with this over here. All right, now if you notice these two integrals, one is positive, one is negative. So then that's going to allow me to cross those two out. And then the only thing I will have left then will be my x times e raised to the x squared plus c. Okay, so um, nice little trick there on how to go about integrating that little bit of algebra to begin with, distributing there, and then recognizing to make this easier for the integration by parts, just kind of rearranging that so everything works out really nice. And there you have a nice, simple, straightforward, probably calc one level integral. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends so they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.